Hi, in this particular video, we'll see like how to fix the connection failed on Fiam application. Okay, so this is one of the error which you might face whenever you are trying to face whenever you are trying to play this particular application that is a Fiam application. So this can be extremely frustrating and ruin your gaming experience whenever you get these kind of errors. Okay, so while Fiam is a great game to play and pass the time, similarly to other games, it can also have a connection issues where it is unable to connect it to the servers properly. Okay, so connecting to the server is a very much important whenever you are trying to play these kind of games. Okay, so in this particular video, we'll see like what are the causes like why you are facing these kind of errors. We also see like how we can fix these kind of particular errors. We'll see the remedies how we can fix these kind of errors. So this is the screenshot of the error what you are facing. There can be many reasons like why you are seeing these kind of errors. So the reasons can range from issues with the DNS server to an issue with the antivirus. So we'll see some of the causes or the reasons like why you are facing this kind of error. So as I told you, the reason number one is there can be an issue with the DNS server. The second cause is Fiam has accumulated too much of junk files the junk uh, some of the junk files in the cache folder and the third cause is you have a antivirus enabled on your system and the fourth cause is firewall is causing issues for fire applications so we'll see like how we can fix this particular error the first method is run fire as an administrator so running Fiam as an administrator on your system is the first option like which you can attempt in order to overcome this particular problem. This can help you to fix this particular issue and resolve the connection problem. So in order to do that, what you can do is like search command or CMD in the search bar of your PC. Then right click on it then select run as administrator. Now type ipconfig slash flush dns and then press enter in the pop window. And now type net windshock, net sh windshock reset and then press enter again. Now type exit and hit enter once you are done. The second method is disable the antivirus. We all have installed antivirus on our system in order to make sure like our system will not get corrupted by downloading the spam files or the junk files from the internet since we are all using the internet like the facing issues with the virus is a common so in order to overcome that like we have installed the antivirus on our system so make sure that you disable the antivirus whenever you are trying to use this file application so once you are done using the Fiam application, again you can re-enable the antivirus on your system. The third method is disable the firewall on your system. Often, sometimes the firewall in our system can consider some apps as threats to our computer. And that's the reason like it will reject any service request going to the app from the app to its server. So what you can do is like you can disable the firewall. So what you can do is like search for the control panel. Then search for systems and security. So here you can see Windows Defender Firewall. Click on that. So once you click on that, turn on the Windows Defender Firewall option. So click on the turn off windows defender firewall option which is not recommended but under private network settings as well as public network settings. So click on ok and then close that particular window. Okay. 
so it is dangerous to disable this firewall so make sure that you re-enable it once you finish playing the game that is a firewall application game okay that's the third method the fourth method is delete the cache folder you should also make sure that you have deleted the cache folder of firewall application so so make sure that go to this firewall application which is you have saved somewhere on your system maybe on your desktop so right click on it so click on open file location now go to firewall application data then select cache file then delete the file inside that cache file okay then the fifth method is change the dns server you can also try to use the different public dns server if you see this that you are not able to connect to firm from the dns server to do that adjust the follow steps go to the control panel from your start menu then select network and internet options now select change adapter settings then right click on the wifi network and then open the properties from the menu select protocol version 4 then click on properties note on the existing dns server for future reference software then you can click on use the following dns server addresses you have to replace those addresses with this then finally you can click on okay and then close the tabs and the sixth method is contact the support team contact support contacting the support team will definitely help you to come up with the problem and the problem will be fixed come up with a solution to that particular problem and the problem will be fixed so what you can do is like you can visit the official website of the support team support.cfx.org so you can click on this submit a request you can select help and support so here you can enter email id and subject for the error what you are facing and here you can enter the entire description of the problem what you are facing finally you can attach the uh, screenshot of the particular error what you are facing so here you can attach that screenshot then finally you can submit this particular request so once you submit the backend team will get back to you they will come up with solution what you are facing and the problem will be resolved okay so that's all about this thank you